Today I'm going to show you how I turned this into its own little magnetic um, eyeshadow holder. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I have a super, super short, quick thing that I did today that I thought I would share. So if you guys have seen my, um, my everyday makeup routine, um, I have this Elate Cosmetics um, makeup magnet case. So I've like depotted um, a lot of my eyeshadows and just put them in here since they're magnetized. Um, but this is pretty big to travel with. It's like the size of a, like an iPad. Um, and it's, it's not glass, but it's plastic here, but it's kind of fragile. So I don't like sticking it in my backpack or in a suitcase. Um, so for the longest time I've wanted to make a smaller little magnet case. Um, and I had this little mint, uh, container and I've been holding on to it for a while and it fits perfectly in my makeup bag. And I was like, oh, the only eyeshadows I really need when I'm traveling or like doing an overnight are my eyebrow eyeshadow, eyebrow shadow. Um, it's the brown eyeshadow that I put in my eyebrow. And then I do a little bit of like a light highlight on my eye. And sometimes I use it um, on my cheeks and my blush. So those are the only powders I really need to travel with. I have a small jam jar that I put a little bit of my loose like foundation powder in and then everything else just fits perfectly into my bag. So this is more like if I'm trying to have fun and like use all the other colors that I have, there aren't actually that many in here, but long story short, today I'm gonna show you how I turned this into its own little magnetic um, eyeshadow holder. <laughs> so with the magic of editing, I've already done this. So I'm just gonna talk through what I did and show you how it looked when I did it. So I had this little mint container for a while. Uh, you can use any container you have really. I just take my container, put it on top of the magnet and trace around the bottom so it'll fit in nicely. And then I cut that out. Um, I had to cut it a little bit smaller than the outline just so it fit in. Um, and then with a little bit of work, you know, shove it in there. You wanna make sure it lays flat because then the magnets will, will stick nicely. Um, and then I just took a little bit of this natural glue that I got from Life Without Plastic. I will tag it below because it's the only plastic free glue that I've ever found and I was so excited to find it. So that I just added into the bottom, stuck the magnet in and then I pulled my eyeshadows out and stuck them on. And then another thing I did because my blush used to be in a bigger tin and it had broke and I have these extra empty tins from other eyeshadows that I have had and used up. And so I was like, oh, this is a perfect time to downsize. So I broke up the uh, blush and made it as fine as I could, poured it into the smaller tin that I had and then pressed it down with another tin that was the same size. So I kind of just like sandwiched them together. And then I put some rubbing alcohol into this little pipette and I just dripped a few drops of that on top. And as that, oh, and I squished it one more time. And then as the rubbing alcohol evaporates, the um, powder will stay pressed. So that's basically what I did. And I got this cutie little travel makeup tin. Um, and if I really wanted to, I could paint the top here, but I don't think I will. I like the little minimalist look. It kind of looks like a little pill case, but I just have my highlight eyeshadow, my brow eyeshadow and my blush. And that's all I really need when I am traveling or doing like an overnight trip um, with friends or something. So there's that. I hope this was helpful to somebody on the internet. Um, yeah, if you like it, like it. Please uh, subscribe if you want more content like this. I have more stuff coming. I have been having so much fun making these videos and talking with you guys in the comments. So if you have anything to share, any tips and tricks in the low waste realm, uh, please leave them below. I love you guys. Thanks for making this a fun experience. <laughs> I will catch you in the next one. Bye guys.